vehicle. The only problem here is that anybody has access to this parking lot at any time. One group of vandals using that access to lash out at Tesla founder Elon Musk. It was just one row, then it was a second row, then a third row, then a fourth row. Row upon row of Tesla's new massive cyber truck stored in a nondescript Fort Lauderdale parking lot. I thought Elon Musk uh, put them on sale. I was trying to buy one. They on sale. <laughs> it's in a back of projects where no security, no gates, and then vandals who apparently have a vendetta against Elon Musk, Tesla's founder, <laughs> taking advantage of that lack of security. On each hood of each truck, an expletive targeting Musk. Vandalism is not acceptable. It is illegal. Yasser Ravello noticed the spray-painted vehicles just after 4 in the morning Friday and recorded this video. Fort Lauderdale police say the vandals hit a total of 34 vehicles. All the Tesla trucks. All with the same four-letter word followed with Musk's name. By Friday afternoon, that graffiti had been wiped off. We just heard about it, and then, you know, I wanted to see if it was true, so I came out here, and then I see all these Tesla social media influencers and passers-by stopping to snap some pics. See, like, hundreds of them. There's so many. You don't know why they're here. Of the hulking trucks. I think it's pretty weird to see, like, a back neighborhood you're driving, and you see a bunch of brand-new cyber trucks. Fort Lauderdale police, of course, now in 